This is understandably a very emotional day for the family. Absolutely, Kellyanne. Today would have been little Devin's fourth birthday. Friends and family are honoring him with a balloon release and birthday party here at his gravesite. Now, since the tragedy, the family has been very vocal about helping end the violent crime here in Baton Rouge. Now, Devin was killed by a stray bullet while he was sleeping in bed. Ty Tolliver, his mother, said... She asked her landlord multiple times to let her out of her lease because of safety concerns. Since then, she has filed a wrongful death lawsuit against the real estate company that owns the property she was staying at. At the family's urging, the East Baton Rouge Metro Council passed an ordinance called Devon's Law. This law requires proper safety lighting on rental properties, something the family says could have saved Devon's life. Now, the balloon release is just about to start, and we'll have more tonight from Devin's family about what they're doing trying to end the violent crime here in Baton Rouge. Reporting live, Anam Siddiqui, Fox 44 News. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Juju. Happy birthday to you. Birthday balloon and candles in hand. The number four balloon sits on little Devin Page Jr.'s grave. This is a birthday celebration no mother dreams of. Just to have some type of normalcy, we had to do this today for him. In April, Devin was killed by a stray bullet while sleeping in bed in Baton Rouge. Now, family members are left celebrating his birthday without him. When I pulled up on the graveside, I almost fainted because I could just feel the last time basically I was here was when we were, when we put him in the grave. Grandmother Kathy Tolliver is on a mission to advocate against gun violence. Just four days into the new year, Baton Rouge saw its first homicide. Tolliver calling this unbelievable. I was just hurt. I am so hurt. Uh, I just couldn't believe it. And I'm telling you now, there's an urgency in my spirit to cry out in this city. Those that don't personally know the Tolliver family, like Selena Charles from Houston, came just to Louisiana to celebrate. I just have a heart, you know, for families. The community has to stick together. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you.